Hey guys, I thought I would do my Friday reads. And I am currently reading, let me bring it up. Oh, sorry, I'm shaking this while I'm turning stuff. Okay. I'm reading Western Brides by Lori Rutt. Robinson. Now this is a collective of authors. It's three different authors. There's Le Hi, Lena Bannon and Carol Arlins. I have read... Hey guys, we need a marshmallow. Okay, hang on. Okay. I've read A Bride and Baby for Christmas by Lauren Robinson so far. I've read the first uh, novella. And that was really good. I loved it. So I am on to Miss Christmas, Miss Christina's Christmas Wish by Lina, Lina, Lena Bannon. And this is dedica dedicated new teacher Christina Mel Marlene Fields. Sorry, I'm bad at names. Her heart race as she watches Ivan, I cannot say his last name, I'm sorry, chop wood for the school. She had ruled out marriage, but Christmas is a time when miracles can happen. And this is a 20 chapter novella book with a fast forward at the end, just one little page. So I technically think that that is just a regular horror queen book. But it's in with the three stories. So, to me, that's not a novella. That is a romance full book. So, anyways, I'm going to read that this weekend. And, sorry, I mentioned. I'm going to read Adam in the Seven Sons um, series by Kristen Osborne and Amelia Adams. I'm going to finish that because it's only 10 chapters. And then I'm going to take a break from Kindle Unlimited. Just for the month of December. I've already paid for it the, for the year. But um, I'm wanting to read just Christmas books for the month of December. So, between Adam and the Chris, Western Christian Brides and... I need to finish Marrying for King's Millions. This is book two and the Kings of California. I'm 55% of the way through, so I should be done with that this weekend. So between that and um, Adam, I should have two more books done. And then I'll see how it goes. So, we'll see. I still haven't started Thanksgiving Protector. I need to start that this weekend. So, once the other two are finished, I guess I will start Thanksgiving Protector and finish through my physical Christmas book I'm reading. <coughs> and we're also... <coughs> I'm sorry. My, my throat itches. We are voting in the Harquin monthly theme group that I'm running, which book to read next for Christmas, and it will start on, let me look it up real quick, oh, I'm sorry I'm not high as tech as everybody else, um, A Scandalous Christmas Ball, it's a novella, and um, that's voting for Western Christmas Propo um, Proposals. Them are uh, three novellas. And there's Christmas, The Cowboy's Christmas Proposition by Silver James. That is number seven or eight in her series. So we will see. Let me see real quick. I think it's seven. See, I bought the ebook, but I've also got a physical copy too. Come on. Seven. 
sorry. So, and most of these you can read out of order anyway. I just like to read in order because I get to know each um, person in their story and stuff. You feel like um, you're part of the community and stuff. But either way, you don't always have to read them in order. I usually don't, especially if I get them like at um, <sighs> library book sale or if I just have money just to get the one book in a series, I just read it and then I go back and read my order. I've done it a lot of times. Anyways, that's what I'm reading this weekend, and that's what we're voting on in the group. Um, if you want to join the Horror Quinn monthly themed reading group that I'm doing on Facebook, I'll leave the link down below. And I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. And if you're in the States, I hope you had um, a good holiday, a good Thanksgiving and stuff. And I will talk to you later. Bye, guys.